Kendrick was my first like love for like all rap. And then Drake, he's the GOAT. He literally never misses. Mm. But I'm not gonna lie, this is a battle for the ages, bro. It's actually kind of tweaks. It's, it's OD. Is it compared to how it was in the 90s with like Ice Cube and all them? Or like Tupac and I'm uh, not gonna Biggie? lie. I don't want to say them niggas are ass, but they were like the pioneers. So it's hard. Yeah, yeah it's it's actually really it's actually real beef. Not uh, like so you, you like do you think that you think Kendrick and Drake are faking it? That's why I want to really mm -hmm. ask. You don't think so? You not think? even a little bit. Check this right. Yeah. So niggas forget that Pusha T killed Drake. And my yeah. people forget is because when he talks about his son, Drake stopped dropping diss tracks. He's like, damn, <laughs> you know, I got a kid. And then he started flexing his kid now. Yeah, 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 yeah. So Kendrick, bro, you didn't even. So people, he didn't even listen to like last night. This literally happened last night. So y'all getting it fresh off the dome. Yeah, literally. Last night I was about to go to bed. Drake dropped. I'm like, yo, this is hard. Like a seven minute track. Hard. Yeah. Then I'm gassing. I'm like, yo, he just killed Kendrick. I can't believe it. I'm talking to the homies. I'm like, this is crazy. 15 minutes later, Kendrick says, well, you thought I was pussy? And dropped. <laughs> and when Kendrick dropped, like, so, I'm not gonna lie, I kind of gotta go over everywhere where Drake killed him, bro. You gotta go over everywhere? I gotta go over everything, bro. Where Drake and Kendrick killed each other. Yeah, yeah, So, let me go over to tears first. So, you don't think that's not, like, staged, bro? Not a, <sighs> That's kind of that's kind of weird. Because they're exposing, do you know what the stuff they're exposing? Like, Drake got a daughter? So, Drake got a daughter. Drake's a I've been saying this. Yeah, yeah. Tom hey, hey, hey. I've been saying this for years. Hey, I've been saying this for two years, Ty. You leaked it to Kendrick? You told Kendrick? Yo, you yeah. heard the pod, bro. I've been saying this forever. No way he said that. No, he said it. Like, OD. I've been... He freaking... supposed he has another kid. He exposed that he's a... Like, he, he be sleeping that, with 17? That he raped somebody and paid, it, paid him bread to get rid of it. Oh, my... Drake got slapped up by Diddy. What do you mean? Like, like, no, like punch in the face. Oh, oh. <laughs> Diddy punched him. And oh, um, Drake didn't do nothing about it. Wow. Um... Then he exposed um, how he how he only uses Adonis because Adonis is more marketable. Yeah. If you look at pictures of his daughter, yeah, yeah. No disrespect to you know, it's a kid, but <laughs> she she isn't like she's not like a pretty looking kid, not a marketable kid. Yeah, yeah, I know. Where what you Adonis, mean. you know the the, the blue, blue eyes, eyes curly hair. Yeah, that's a marketable kid. Uh, but the daughter is not. She, she looks look, like a normal like, kid. Yeah, if not on you know, like if you side. had told me that's Drake, I would never knew. Like Drake, right. that's what like, I'm saying. You feel me? So wow. that's why he doesn't use her. Then on top of that, like Kendrick, like so this this this, this let me just go over this. Yeah, yeah I gotta go put ahead, some go some some precepts to this. Go right? ahead, go ahead, go ahead. The three Drake Cole, yeah, Drake Kendrick. We were arguing about this in the chat before, so they're the three top, in mm -hmm. my opinion. Yeah, yeah. Drake is the best music maker. He makes hits. He doesn't miss. Yep, that's yep. what he does. Mm -hmm. Kendrick has the best bars. Best lines. Okay, okay. His lines don't... His lines are double entendres or triple entendres. I'm not talking about line to line, whatever. J. Cole is a balance between the two, mm -hmm. but he's the best, like, just line for line that goes hard. Mm -hmm. He's the easiest to listen to. Uh, okay, I get what you mean. J so, like, if you're not like me, I'm a big music guy. So, I listen to music. Like, I can listen to Kendrick and be like, yo, you peep the two things he put together in this. Mm -hmm. Whereas if you just listen to music because you just want to hear some bars, J. Cole is that guy. You're going to yeah, listen to J. Cole. You're going, you and you're just like, oh, yeah, it's cool. The beat is hard. This is hard. Mm -hmm. Now, in terms of making great music, it's Drake first, J. Cole second, then Kendrick, then Kendrick. Eric. Okay. But for bars, it's Kendrick, then it's J. Cole, then it's Drake. Right? Kendrick, J. Okay. Then it's Drake. Then for easiest to listen to, then it's, it's J. Cole, mm -hmm. then it's Drake, then it's Kendrick. Yeah. But either way, they're all top three. Mm hmm. Now, we gotta go. Now we're gonna go into this this this, this thing, right? Uh huh. Did you the picture that was used when Kendrick dissed Drake was a picture of uh, what's called Drake's father's briefcase mm -hmm. that he lost somewhere in a plane or some shit. Yeah, Kendrick has it. What's in that briefcase? Basically, he robbed his father. <laughs> Kendrick robbed Drake's father. It, the picture of the 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 song cover. Yeah, he robbed his father. Really? They basically type shit. That's what I go. Wait, what's it? Had a black glove in it. Yeah. The black the black glove was a triple entendre relating to um OJ. I was gonna say OJ. No. Nah. OJ, and then also making fun of Drake because he says Michael Jackson all the time. Ah. And also he's saying he's about to he's been killed he's about to kill this nigga. Which literally yeah, like yeah with the, going you got in. the gloves yeah I got you going mean. in. All okay. right. But um so this is what with Drake's this his first this how why it went so hard the first part it was a three parter uh huh first part of it was kind of. It was good. It was a little mid. Yeah. But it was just a good song. It mm -hmm. was just, he makes good songs, so he made a good song. The second part is where he had acknowledged all the 35 other rappers that are trying to diss Drake. Yeah. Right? 
So he's like, you know, he talked about Ross, talked about everybody, right? Mm-hmm. He said Rocky, everybody, right? And it was decent. The yeah. third, and then he brought up one thing. So Kendrick has two kids. He brought that one of his kids is the father. No, the father of one of Kendrick's kids isn't his. Really? It is Dave Free. Dave Free. Oh, that's what he was saying? Yeah. You know what Dave Free is? Is he Dave, like a producer? Yeah, or he's like the producer and he's like, he does like, like A&R stuff for like a whole bunch of West Coast rappers. Yeah, yeah, you yeah. You feel me? But he's real tight with Kendrick. He's saying that his, he, he fucked Kendrick's his, wife and had the kid oh. and that's his kid. I looked at the pictures. Me personally, I looked at the pictures of Dave Free <laughs> and I looked at the pictures of Kendrick's little boy. I'm not going to lie. They look, look alike? more like Kendrick Lo- and the baby's light skin. So I'm just saying. Wait, is his wife light skin? His, his wife is like really white light skin and then Dave Free is light skin. So, oh, but Kendrick's okay. darker than him. Okay, so what? Like, it's like, uh, like, is it like my light skin? Who the kid? Yeah, the kid. The kid is like your light skin. Oh dang! But like, yeah. okay. So, oh, how man. old are the kids? One of the kids probably like I think like four now. And oh, then the daughter is probably like two years older, three years old. Oh, so they're young kids. They're babies. Yeah. Oh wow, like Adonis. But so then look, they, he just brought up that day free shit. That shit made me go. <laughs> in the in the video, yeah. The the minivan he had, right? Uh-huh. That was he was crushing a minivan. It was the same minivan that was used in Good Kid Mad City, Kendrick's number one album yeah, yeah. of all time that he's made. And he like was destroying it, basically saying, I'm about to destroy you too, Kendrick, right? Now you fast forward. The third part starts off. So in the last disc that Kendrick had, it was um and this is why I'm like, yo, Drake. Is that out the of one where he said where he was like, You can't say the N word? He started off the entire song saying "nigga." That yeah, was yeah. OD. That was hard. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But the first thing was um, Drake. So Kendrick in his last one, he said a bar. I forgot what it was. Mm-hmm. Something about fried rice. Talk, yeah. and he shouted out the store that had real good, uh, real good eats or whatever. Can yeah, say yeah. that's and that's in Kendrick's hood. It's in the West Coast. That's yeah, yeah. Kendrick's spot. Mm-hmm. The start of the third part of the of the diss, Drake was walking into that store. After hours in Kendrick's hood, eating his fried rice. <laughs> that he said with his fine. feet up, comfortable as hell in Kendrick's hood. Wow. In the bars, he was saying, Kendrick, you don't even go home anymore. Basically saying like, I don't remember the exact words, but he was saying like, Kendrick doesn't go to the hood no more. To, he doesn't go back to LA no more. He doesn't grow no wow. money trees over there. You know the song Money Trees talking about he gives back to his hood. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He doesn't get back to his hood. He lives in New York now. <laughs> he doesn't even, you know what I'm saying? He's talking about this restaurant, but his restaurant don't even... Fuck with you like that because he's able to go in there and eat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And have a good time. Wow. And he's in there with all his homies. <laughs> um, and then, you know, he's over there smiling and shit in the middle of it. It's Max. It's Max. It's wow. Right. That's it was OD. Max. He disrespected him. OD. It was OD. <laughs> then he said he beat his wife. Who? Seeing that Kendrick beat his wife. So that was <laughs> it. He said he, he hit women? Yeah. He hits women, bro. Oh, my gosh. It hit different. Hey, bro. It hit, it hit different. It hit different. It hit different. Sometimes yeah. you just got to hit different, bro. But yeah, so he hit his wife, um, and I'm not gonna lie, the bars he was no, 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 no. You're, you got to see this. You gotta, I can't wait till you talk about the Kendrick part because when I when he's I've been telling y'all Drake is a pedo, bro. There's no way. Yo, he went in. There's no, no way this horny man. But I gotta show you. No, 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 no. No, no. You see this part? Oh, that's the one that's. Is... Isn't that the freaking dude freaking uh that owns uh the owner, he owns the restaurant or owns no that that dude I don't know who that dude is. He's the dude that freaking um I think he created Bape. He might be like Bape owner cuz he used to be with Pharrell. But they're in there having a party eating it, eating the food. Eating the fried rice that the man talk about. Freaking um That's disrespectful as hell. What did he say? Oh yeah, so in the last one when he said uh what Kendrick said, he was like I don't repeat that bar. He was like you talking about uh he's taking up for Pharrell. Yeah. Talking about pushing P. Double entendre because Kendrick really drops some double entendres. Yeah. Don't push a P, push a T. He couldn't push, push a T because push a T killed him in a, in a rap battle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then push a P. He's talking about Pharrell because Drake uh, disrespected Pharrell. Yeah, yeah. Forgot how it was. And then when he disrespected Pharrell, mm-hmm. Kendrick is standing up for Pharrell, Rihanna, and Beyonce. That's why he's starting his whole rap beef shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But regardless though, he Drake said some hard shit. He was like, um, what did he say? He, I think it's in this. He said, "You want to take up for Pharrell." Tell him get his legacy out my crib, some shit. Oh, oh wait, is it Nah, no, it wasn't that one. But he said, um, his whole basically said Pharrell's legacy, which was I think kind of stupid though, because Pharrell's entire legacy, yeah, is actually like built off of his features and other shit. Yeah, and other stuff. Nothing with Drake really. He has a couple songs with Drake. That's about it. Yeah. Um, he talked about his big ass meat paws. Who uh, said that? Drake. Drake. 
Like he, took, he was like, um, there's no big three. It's just a big D. Big Drake. Double entendre. Big Drake. But then, big, you know the video yeah, he yeah, had? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He tweaked. So, yeah, he, he bugged out. Yeah, he's a... Video proof. Yo! That was a bar. What did he say? No, nah, I'm about to run it back. He said... He said, listen... Is it black? You remember when he said he doesn't want him to say nigga? Yeah. So he was like, uh, we should have our sons play at the park. Because they two light-skinned kids? He said, it would be two light-skinned kids playing at the park. But the thing is, because Kendrick talks about black power and all that shit, but he married somebody that's like not black. <laughs> and his son is light-skinned. Yeah. But then he was like, you probably don't want to do that because you don't want to be at the scene with somebody that isn't blacker than you. That oh. was also talking about Kendrick's song. Uh, what's it called? Black and Berry Sweeter Juice. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Going crazy. Drake kind of went hard. <laughs> and then basically also because Kendrick was like, Drake isn't even black. We don't want to hear you say nigga no more. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Funny as hell. Wow. He, he, Is he, he wait, oh, yeah. he's half black. Right? Drake? Yeah, he's half yeah, black. Yeah, Drake's okay. half black. But then he's just gelling off him. But he grew up in Toronto. Yeah, he's gelling off him. He's just cooking over here. Ooh. Oh my gosh. Drake, so Kendrick proposed to Drake in 2015. Kendrick proposed to his wife in 2015. Yeah. And they still aren't married. Nine years, almost 10 years later. <laughs> Basically, like, what? why do you have cold feet about marrying your wife? Yeah. And then the day free shit. Because day free. Oh, girl. so they're trying to like. He's, he's co- correlating them together. Wow. It is kind of crazy. You, 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 She's your fiance for nine years? That's wild. Woman. Especially if the woman, like, the woman would get probably pissed yeah, off. Yeah, exactly. But Kendrick has millions. So it's like. Yeah. Yeah. Oh wait, this is part. This is my favorite part. Wait, what did we say? Is this it? Wait. Where's it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? He says, "Shake that ass for Drake." So shake that ass for free. Shake that ass. Oh yeah, that's what I was listening. To. Yeah, yeah. What he said. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He said that shit again. But yeah. Now, that was Drake. Drake's went dummy hard, but Kendrick was like, I've never been pussy. So Kendrick released 15 minutes later. 15 minutes, like 30, 15 minutes later. I was like, what the heck? I'm laying in my bed. I'm like... I'm waiting to hear this one because I've been... I want to know. Kendrick was like... uh, So Kendrick came in. Did you hear it, Kendrick? I didn't hear it at all. So Kendrick came in with the disc first. First, So the first cover was just the glove Uh and like shit in the background. Yeah. Niggas ain't know what that meant. It was the glove for OJ. And he was signaling like, yo, I'm about to kill you if you keep wilding. He wowed. Then he showed that, yeah, basically I robbed your father. First of all, <laughs> nigga. I got all his shit. This, you feel me? The OJ glove, Michael Jackson, all that shit, right? Yeah, yeah. You don't have the glove. I. You don't have the glove I have. The I'm glove. wearing the glove but now. the glove I have is OJ's glove because I kill niggas. The glove you don't have was Michael Jackson's glove, but you're not even Mike because Mike doesn't Whoa. lose his glove. You feel me? Kendrick really, King Kendrick. I'm trying to tell niggas. So look, <laughs> so check, right? He started off the, the shit. He said, Dear Adonis, and he, the whole verse, it was like another six, seven minute one. Yeah. This is why I say it's road rap because other people, like, they released a song that's two minutes long. Yeah. They were releasing seven minute tracks. I know, that's what I'm Yo, saying. That shit was a long ass song. Kendrick said, Dear Adonis, and basically, he was, he was talking about how uh, Drake doesn't raise you and doesn't care about you, and he's a and oh all, he was just this, he was basically talking about like so did he actually and he was he was talking to him like Kendrick was talking to Adonis like he is Adonis' father that's oh. the most disrespect <laughs> like imagine like imagine like you have a kid and somebody come in and like come on let me teach you a lesson and trying to give him advice and talk to him like he's that like nigga I'm right here nigga that's yeah, my yeah, son yeah yeah that's wild it's disrespectful yeah, yeah yeah verse ends second verse he said dear Mrs. Graham talking about talking to uh, Drake's mom Oh my god. Nigga gosh. started talking to his mom <laughs> and said, You raised a piece of shit. Like, <laughs> and he said that word for word, like, You raised a piece of shit, son. Like, and he said, I'm sorry, you have to go to whatever the case is. But now I have to air everything out. And basically said how he goes after girls who are under 17. I've been and sick. pays them. And then when they, you know what I'm saying? Like, and then um, there's a, uh, uh, what's it called? There's like video, there's like a whole bunch of videos now on the internet of Drake like on stage bringing up little girls or like Drake like um like going at, like going to like casinos or whatever with yeah. like girls who look underage and shit bro geeking I've been saying this ever since they locked R. Kelly up yeah. it's gonna bro I said Drake is the same thing but he just didn't get caught 
Bro, Drake talk about women all the time, bro. Drake said he got a woman in every state. There's these... There's not that many... Sorry, no, there's bro, not that many bro, there's... Bro, there's these girls out here that be like 16, 15 that look like they're 21. You don't think Drake ever slid in DMs by accident? And he's like, you know, I don't care. But he's Drake. He can let but it But he's rock. Drake. He can let it because he can hide it. Yeah, people is... Yo, I've been trying to tell y'all. Y'all think it's that? He also talked about how one of the girls pleaded, like, talked about... Well, so he also talked about one of the girls was like... um Trying to go to the police about it and all that. Yeah, yeah. And he paid her like five hundred twenty thousand dollars to shut the fuck up. That's it. I need a mill. I'm I, not. I need. A, I need Drake. If if Drake took advantage of me, bro, it is what it is. Nah, <laughs> but <laughs> yo, I just need like a hundred k. A hundred k is Drake. What that mean exactly? A uh, one million dollars. You also got the fuck Drake, bro. No, he he. I didn't want to. Like yeah, but it's Drake. That's a flex. That's, yeah, it's a that flex. flex is I'm worth that, that flex is worth four hundred k. And I got Brett. That flex is worth four hundred k. I could get a million. No, you can't. I can't. I could get a million out of that dude. I don't think you could, bro. Well, you gonna kill me? Probably. Yeah. Probably. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah <laughs> he'll probably yeah, make yeah. it like an accident too. Like he'll just. It, it'll probably cost him five hundred k to make sure you're done up. Yeah, yeah. that's true. You probably call a hitman costs like ten k. Why you know that? <laughs> he's just a, in case he's a, <laughs> but forget uh so then he said that about that about that shit oh my gosh then he talked to, then he said uh dear whatever her name is his other his other daughter oh my gosh and basically talked about um his daughter saying like you know he doesn't talk to whatever the case is and he just started ripping him doing it and it was somebody else i forgot who else he talked i think that's his best friend how did he know that? I didn't listen to the end part because I was doing something. The last part, the like last minute, the last person he talked to, but it, it came back right away. How did he know he had a daughter? Kendrick, bro. Wow. Yo, they got they really got some private investigators. And then there was something else that popped up. It was uh, Drake had a tweet, and it, it said, um, it was in 2015. Yeah. And he just said, baby girl. And that was the same time he got the allegations of having a, having a daughter, and nobody... Ah, uh, and he just said "baby girl" for no reason. Wow, bro. Nah, this is a crazy thing. So that's what I'm saying. I feel like Drake has way more kids than he's talking. It's Drake, about. it's Drake, bro. I'm telling you, he got like maybe Max, bro. He was putting hot sauce in his condoms. Exactly. He, he come on, bro. And I feel like he probably not. He probably has more kids, and he probably aborted a lot of kids. Dang. He probably, yo, you know, bro. you know, bro. He probably, he probably went to Colombia and. Did went crazy. There's probably a kid in Columbia look like Drake. Yeah, it was OG. I'm going to go get it. I'm going to go get it. I'm going to go get it.